So what's good with y'all? As y'all can see by today's title and thumbnail, I'll be doing another hoodie collection video. Now, as y'all can see by the big pile that I showed y'all, and y'all can still see this shit inside the frame while I'm doing the intro, I got a lot of hoodies. I take very high pride in my hoodie collection. I feel like hoodies are the best thing when it comes to putting on a fit, clothes, whatever. Hoodies is really like... Besides shoes, but hoodies is really like that, feel me? I just fuck with hoodies. I really don't got too much to say for the intro, but I'm gonna just go through the hoodies and tell y'all some good sights either in between the video or at the end. Y'all just see regardless, but but yeah, I ain't gonna do too much talking. It's gonna be a straightforward type of video, and if, bro, if I look a little bit rusty, I got the hair up. Trust me, bro, if you a dreadhead, if you wanna start a lot of phase, bro, cause nowadays, bro, my hair getting so long, it's to the point, I don't even, bro, I don't want this shit in my face no more, bro. I be having thoughts in my mind saying, bro, I have to cut this shit off. But I'm like, nah, 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 that'd be, that'd be my intrusive thoughts trying to talk to me. Like, like, it's like, it's like my intrusive thoughts want me to get nerfed. I can't do that. I can't do that. But besides all that talking, let's hop into this video. Let's get into it. All right, Charles, I'm starting with the first hoodie at the top. This is probably one of my favorite all-time hoodies in my collection. I'm not going to lie. We got the I'm Happy Promise hoodie. I got this hoodie a minute ago off Depop. I don't think this was like an official release from Forrest, but it was at the time I had first started following him. I wanted I wanted one of his hoodies. I ain't going to lie, this shit was tough. And then he had posted his Depop, and supposedly he had like hella samples on his page. He had black pink i think and then he had this one it was a lot to choose from but obviously green is my favorite color so i just said why not picked up the green one and this is for sure all time one of my favorite hoodies in my collection right now i'm not gonna lie i do not regret buying this at all this shit is so tough keep going for us i got hella pieces from him i ain't gonna lie all right y'all so next up we got this hoodie active supply hoodie when i first got this hoodie this was probably my favorite hoodie in my collection but at that time i was really thrifting like heavily thrifting and i found this in the thrift store i used to wear this shit every day bro same little combo joggers active supply hoodie i threw this shit on like it was only thing i had bro but nowadays i'm glad i don't wear this as much i got way more hoodies now so i don't really be looking at this one for real for real but this for sure one of my favorite hoodies still in my collection next up on my list we have this green hoodie i got this off depop i ain't got hoodies like this i honestly fuck with the most like it got that oversized fin to it and again it has it's my favorite color green if y'all don't know i just stretched the hood on this so that when I put on the chain, it just goes straight down. Cool little add-on I did. I'm telling y'all, bro, I'm really starting to get into this clothes shit, like. Cool little hoodie. Now, next up, we got this ditch hoodie. I ain't gonna lie, I have yet to wear this hoodie. I really don't know why, to be honest. It got this, the reason why I got it is because it got, like, this little, like, the hood is right here, and then the mask, like, covers up your face. So I was gonna wear, like, my Yeezy boots with it. That shit was gonna be fine. I might still wear that fit soon, I don't know, but depending on what the weather looking like, and, and if I even take those flicks, we gonna see, but, and I overall fuck with it. It's like a calm little blank, and then the hood is an add-on, so. Not too crazy. Haven't worn it yet, but I plan on wearing it soon for y'all. Now, next up, we got this Astro hoodie. Now, I ain't gonna lie, bro. This is this this hoodie gives me memories. I'm not gonna lie. This is one of the first times I modeled for Astro. I think I modeled for Astro like three or three times, maybe. And this is when I think it was the second piece that I modeled for. And it's crazy, bro. Looking back at these, like, damn, man. I'm gonna let y'all read it. Feel me, dreams into reality. At first, I was gonna get a black one, but I think she had ran out or they didn't make the black ones right. So, like I said, green is my favorite color so i never really complained about getting a green piece and i should know bro i shouted out astro a couple times in my um videos her shit is crazy bro i'm not gonna lie so shout out astro next hoodie on my list is this bait hoodie i'm gonna lie, i barely wear this hoodie at all i used to want i used to want a bait hoodie like crazy last year around the time last year but i just outgrew it a little bit i ain't gonna lie it's not really my style but i still fuck with it i still wear it shout out babe i fuck with babe though bait far bait far bait far fuck with babe heavy now i'm really crazy to it and uh, yeah. Now next hoodie on my list. This is another hoodie that I rarely wear, mainly because I don't wear it to school. This shit is like heavyweight, like literally just heavy, heavyweight. I got this hoodie from a Cardi concert back in 2020, 2022 in December. Wait, is it 2020? Nah, it was 2021. I got this hoodie when Cardi went on tour. That was probably the craziest tour whole lot of red tour that shit was crazy but rico nasty hoodie this shit was so tough when i first got this bro i was happy as hell like shout out to my mom bro because every time i go to concerts and she with me bro she always makes sure i get the merch like i gotta get the merch raises across north america 2021 shout out cardi shout out rico nasty shout out the whole open your man you feel me all right next up on my list this is another hoodie i haven't worn yet my bad bro i know it's a lot of hoodies that i don't wear but a lot of hoodies i'll be saving for pics i ain't gonna lie like i don't like to wear shit until i take a picture of it this was a custom 
custom made hoodie. I forgot the name off rip, but I still follow her on Instagram. I'm gonna pop her page up if y'all wanna cop something. I don't know if she make clothes still, like personally for people now, but I got this a minute ago, so she might still. I don't know for sure, but she cool peeps. All black, feel me? All black. But then we go to the goddamn pocket on that. Listen, listen it's just detail, small detail. I've never knew this shit had a whole zipper in it, bro. This is a whole pocket, bro. I did ass never realized this shit until now, but hold on. Let me show you the pocket first. It's another pocket. I I knew I've been knew it was a pocket on it on the sleeves, but I didn't know it was an actual zipper part. That shit tough, bro. Another one as so like this shit so far to me, man. Like man, like the same people make their own clothes and then putting that shit into reality is just so far to me, bro. But all black hoodie. It's like a cargo y type of hoodie. I say. That might be low-key cringy, but cargo we type of hoodie. Y'all can barely see. Like, it's literally, like, y'all can barely see it, bro. It's literally, like, black on black. Shout out her. I'm gonna wear this soon. Trust me, I'm gonna wear this soon. Another thrifted hoodie. Now, y'all probably seen this hoodie in my How to Crop hoodie video. I ain't gonna lie. I butchered this hoodie, bro. It's still fast to this day, but to be honest, I won't lie. I will be honest. I low-key like it better when it wasn't cropped. I had to use it for the video, though, so it is what it is, but, you know, 2008. A little vintage to it. And then on the back, I don't know who Hanky is, bro. But I'm representing. Shout out my nigga Hanky. Cropped it on both sides of the sleeves. Cropped at the bottom. Cropped on the hood. Y'all know my body. But feel me? Cool little old little vintage hoodie. Not too crazy. Not special. I still wear it to this day a lot. But not as much. But it's still far. Alright y'all. So next up. I've previewed these hoodies a lot. I'm not gonna lie. But we have the Moju Mojo. I know I'm probably saying the name completely wrong. But Moju Mojo hoodies. They like the... Uh, acid wash type of hoodie all around and they come distressed if y'all don't know like little parts of the hoodie is distressed a little bit hood i've been thinking about copping some more from them i'm not gonna lie which i want to but i can't splurge because if i go on there i'm gonna fuck around by 10 hoodies i'm not gonna lie so we gonna wait to do that <laughs> we gonna wait to do that but shit fa cool little hoodie muju mojo like i said i'm probably saying the name wrong my bad and then here go the brown one right here same concept um, I don't wear these as much, but I'm glad to have them in my collection. I put them on here and there. I'm going to scroll or something like that. But same concept, like I said, the stress on the hood, bro. I ain't gonna lie. This was a nut. This was a crazy impulsive box at the time. At the time, these was going crazy. Everybody wanted a spider hoodie, but I feel like they highly overpopulated now. It's still hard as hell, but you rarely see me rocking this. I'm not gonna lie, but I'm glad I got it into my collection. Free Young Thug, man. Free Young Thug. I low-key want another one. I want the green one, but I don't know. Like I said, that's another impulsive buy. I don't know if I'm willing to take, but I probably will soon. Who knows, but shout out Spider, shout out Young Thug. Now, next up on my list, we have this thrifted hoodie. Y'all probably have seen this hoodie a couple times. I don't know if I made a video on this hoodie yet or not. I probably did. I just don't remember. This is another hoodie where I say I can find like 10 hoodies like this on Depop. Like I said, I'm, I'm going I'm to tell y'all what to do at the end of the video so y'all... I, I gotta, cause I gotta put y'all on, bro. We locked in. I got y'all what to put on. I'm not gonna gatekeep. Usually I gatekeep, but I'm gonna tell y'all where I find these type of hoodies at. Cool little team hoodie. I don't know what team it is, but shout out the bees. No. Calm little blue hoodie. Nothing too crazy to talk about this one. This one was thrifted as well. A lot of people be saying the thrift store's trash fell off. Bro, y'all not looking in on right spots, bro. Y'all not. Can't be. Can't be. But, like I said, calm little hoodie, calm little navy. Yo, this hoodie is a hoodie I got off Depop. It's okay the same color as the ditch hoodie, but a little bit lighter. But, bro, when I seen this on Depop, it was all black. Now, when it came, luckily, like, I wasn't complaining that it was this color, but I was looking for a black North Face hoodie. But this one is still far, still cool. I wear this currently, and I also did the little hood distress so I can wear my chain straight down. And, um, yeah, but this shit far, feel me? Cool little North Face. I always wanted a North Face hoodie. I want some North Face, like, track joggers. Them hard as hell. I'm not gonna lie, some little oversized North Face track joggers. I'm cooking right now. Yeah, cool little North Face hoodie. Not too crazy. I got this off Depop as well. Yeah, it's a cool little blank. It's a cool little hoodie all black. Now, the reason the thing about this one is, I low-key, like, this hoodie is, like, OD oversized. I cut the sleeves on this as well, so... Cool little adding to it, but the thing about this one, like, these is old D oversized, but I fuck with it though. Now, next up, we have another Astro piece. I modeled for these hoodies recently as well. Probably one of my favorite drops from her, to be honest, with the black wording and a little distressing on the words. Cool though, like I said, her shit, all, her, bro, all Astro shit is tough, so I don't really expect less. And then we have two lucky hoodies. This is one of them right here. Another lucky hoodie that I got. My mom always makes sure I get the merch. She had never let me down when it comes to the merch. And then on the back, it got like all the little tour dates on it. As y'all can see, another lucky hoodie. For me, cool little like alien design on the front. Like again, I don't wear these hoodies as much, but 
I will always keep them just for the memories. This one was a to Neptune and back tour. Also had the tour dates on it as well at the bottom. And yeah, Kwan little hoodie. Shout out the Gators. I don't know if this is football, or whatever. I just fuck with it. I fuck with the coloring. Crop hoodie neck on this one as well. Like I do that. I do that on most of my hoodies. That's like my signature. I ain't gonna lie. And then for the last hoodie, we have another Astro hoodie piece. I ain't gonna lie. This hoodie is not oversized. It's like a crop filling type of hoodie, but it's still hard as hell. We got this, and then the reason I really got it was because of the patchwork. Like patchwork, OD crazy. Really the main reason why I copped this shit. This shit hard as hell. I ain't gonna lie. But that was indeed my last hoodie in the collection. I'm about to sit down and talk to y'all right quick so I can let y'all know where I caught most of them hoodies from. First thing you want to do, this is where I get like most of my hoodies from. Click on, go to Depop. Go to Depop. This is where you're going to find like the little sports hoodies, the vintage hoodies, all that. So look, off rip, you can already peep the little vibe of it. As soon as you log into my app, hoodie right here, $25. And then it's just like... And then the good thing about Depop is all you got to do is scroll down and you're going to find hella familiar pieces that relates to the one that you was just on. Another sports hoodie right here. Another one right here. This one low-key. Oh, no. Got a kid You feel me? But now, though, if you don't want to do that, just look up Russell's athletic hoodies. Russell probably has the best sports hoodies, blanks, whatever, as y'all can see. Literally, just scroll down. Hoodies on hoodies. Whoa. Now, uh, yeah, though, so literally everything you need, blanks, sports hoodies. Let me see if I can find another one. Come here, sports hoodies on sports hoodies. Literally. But, um, yeah, so that's pretty much how I do. Literally, just go on here, look up Russell Athletic Hoodies, hella blanks, sweaters, whatever you need, gonna pop up. Those for those hoodies. Now for the Muju Mojo blanks, I'm gonna pop they side up on the screen for y'all as well. The Astro pieces, the Forest hoodie. I'm gonna pop all this stuff up on the screen so y'all can see. But most of these drops or most of these hoodies that I showed y'all are mainly thrifted, picked up pieces or Depop. So you really just gotta look up with it. I ain't gonna lie with some of the pieces. But for most of them, you can just literally go on the site, find related pieces or find that exact piece on the website. So that's pretty much all y'all really gotta do. But bro, go thrift, bro. I've been preaching this to y'all since day one. Go thrift thrift bro literally you don't know what you can find half of the pieces that i found are from the thrift store literally bro i just looked up you gotta look though you can't just go in there expect to just find some shit off the rip you have to like scroll through the sections bro i ain't gonna lie bro but but that pretty much is it for my hoodie collection um christmas is coming up so i might be get some more hoodies or pieces whenever that time comes but oh wait i'm tripping i forgot this hoodie my hold on hold on my, my bad job i'm tripping I'm tripping, bro. I forgot this hoodie itself. I'm tripping, y'all. My bad, bro. My bad, y'all. I'm, tri I'm tripping, bro. I literally knew I was going to end up forgetting about this hoodie that I had on, bro. Like, I I'm tripping, bro. I'm tripping, bro. Aoism. I ain't gonna lie. I, I probably butcher bro name, but Aoism. I'm gonna pop this Instagram up so I can go cop some from him as well. I think he about to drop some Halloween hoodie soon. His shit crazy. I ain't gonna lie. And it's hella oversized. And so, yeah, but besides all that, bro, I have to mention this hoodie. So I know a lot of y'all probably gonna be like, this nigga forgot the main hoodie that I wanted, bro. So I got y'all though, but um, like I said, I've been trying to post every other day, if not every day, bro. So besides all that, I love y'all. Keep going for me. I'm keep going for y'all. And your boy Vine is out, man. Peace. Go get fly. I ain't got no love for no bitch, but you the golden one, real holy one. She the star, she call me Obi Wan. Other bitches walk around like a nigga. For no bitch, but you the golden one, real holy one. She a star, she call me Obi Wan. Other bitches walk around like a nigga on some.